What's up, guys? Mike Dakota here. You know, I was doing Code Chef Long the contest the other day, and then I realized something. I actually personally believe that Code Chef is actually way better for beginners in terms of beginners to learn competitive programming. And here's the reason why. As I'm doing these problems on Code Chef, I realize that month long contests, it really forces you to try your hardest, like the very best at a problem. So like I've, there, there's frog sort. I literally tried the absolute hardest to try to solve this problem. Now, ordinarily, if you were to just do the problems on code forces, you just go to the editorial and then just copy and paste the code. But on code chef, if you go to these problems, right, you can't like during a month long contest, you can't really, you can't really, there's no editorial like yet. Right. So you're, it forces you to actually try your absolute hardest on doing these problems. And that, that really changes the way that you to do problem solving because you're not relying on copy and pasting the editorial. Now, another thing that I like about Code Chef is that they actually have a, um, a learning series. So they have a data structures and algorithms learning series, which the, you could actually do a bunch of problems on here. So it gives you like the different different types of problems that you could do while you're a beginner competitive programmer and you'd solve all these problems. And then you'll be able to, you know, do better in these contests because you have the series and try solving the problems. And then in case you're stuck, check out the hints for the pride for uh, provided for the problems. So they have a bunch of problem sets that you could do. Whereas on code forces, they do have like a numbering system for the ranking on which problems you solve, but they don't have like a, I wouldn't say they don't have like a really learning series for data structures and algorithms tailored for that. They do have like other things, uh, other series that you could probably work on, but yeah, that's another thing why I like code chef. Another thing about code chef that I like about it and why I think it's a little better than code forces is that you do not have the option to look at the tests. So like when you, when you submit something, let's say on code chef meetings, right? Once you finish a submission, you can't look at the test cases. Right. So you can't, I can't look at what did I, what were the test cases for to get a seat? And that's good. And why is this a good thing? Because normally when you solve problems on code forces and you're able to look at the test cases, um, you just look at the, you rely too much on the test cases to solve the problems. And then once you rely too much on the test cases, well, you, you can't really, you look at the test cases during the contest, right? You're only allowed to look at it after the contest. So if you rely too much on the test cases, you're not really improving. Whereas on Code Chef, if they don't, don't even give you the test cases, you're actually more likely to solve the problem yourself. So those are the reasons why I believe Code Chef, Code Chef is better for beginners to do competitive programming. So beginners like me, I am a beginner in competitive programming. And that's the reason why I like Code Chef better in this regard. Okay, now here's some downsides about Code Chef. Um, these contests, most people don't really take these seriously for long contests. And the reason, like your ranking, they don't take your ranking seriously. Reason why is because too many people on Code Chef cheat. Like they would go to ask their friends and copy and paste code from their friends and do stuff like that just to boost their ranking. Because for some reason, I don't know, when you have a high ranking on Code Chef, you're more likely to do better. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it works, but, but th that's the thing. On Code Chef, if somehow if you have a high ranking, you're you're more likely to I don't know get an interview. So that's why people cheat on these contests. But that is that's a thing that uh, if you just get rid of that, that's more mostly of a people thing, not really the con Code Chef itself. But another thing I like about Code Chef is that because you're doing a long contest, you get to look up stuff. So and otherwise you normally wouldn't be able to do in a short contest. So you you could learn more more things. Like I could look up a new new formula or something to solve the problem. I could look up other things. I could try out absolute hardest to solve these problems. And then once I solve it, it's good. So that's a reason main reasons I want to give about why Code Chef is better for beginners. But um, in terms of like your ranking and stuff like that, um, I think that Code Forces is better in terms of matching your ranking like with whatever problem you're doing like if you have like um i don't know rank one rating 1100 or something right if you it, it's it has a good system in that you're if you were to if you have a rating 1100 you could solve any problem rating of 1100 50 percent of the time right and that's pretty good whereas on coach chef you can't really do that like if you have if you go on coach chef and go to like problem sets uh, search problems by tags, right? 
Um, oh, wow. Wow, this is really strange. Okay, uh, let me see. How do I even compete? Compete problems? I'm trying to look at search problems. Yeah, uh, they don't really give you the the problems to to do. Like, they don't give you, like, a numbering way to do it. They just have me, uh, short, medium, and long, I think. Let's see. All past contest divisions. I'm trying to see. Search problems. Oh, difficulty level. Yeah. So they only have beginner, easy, medium, hard, and a challenge, and then peer. So they don't really have, like, um, they don't have, like, a better system in terms of your rating. Like, they don't give you problems you could solve for your rating. But that's just how, uh, the reason why I like Code Chef better. Um, another reason why I like Code Chef, why Code Chef is better for beginners is that this is just a personal thing. I get too many, uh, too many messages on Code Forces that are trolls. And then, and then I, I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> so that's why if you do problems on Code Chef, you're, you're, there's no, there's no inbox, right? So you're, you're, you can't, you can't get it any people to send you messages trolls to send you messages stuff like that so that's the reason why i like coach chef but yeah those those are the main reasons why i think coach chef is better for beginners is that they have like a learning series you could do and they have problem sets you could do they have the editorial and they kind of force you to do these problems you know but let's let me know what you guys think let me know if you think that coach chef is better or code force is better Anyway, rate, comment, subscribe. I can't live stream today, so that's the reason why I'm making this video. But yeah, I'll check you guys later. Peace.